Hello guys, welcome back to Adventures of Well and Me, and today we are going to be continuing our Museum of Gaming A to Z uh, in the Nintendo 64 console games. Now, this is the first game for the B games, um, and it is Banjo-Kazooie, one of my all-time favourite games on the Nintendo 64. Um, countless times I've played it through um, with my brother and beaten the game. And then Banjo Tooie as well. We've played that. Um, yeah, they're so expensive now as well on eBay. It's uh, one of those games that just skyrockets in price because everyone loves it. Um, so we're going to play uh, 15, 20 minutes of the game, probably longer because I like this game so much. Um, and then I'll give you an honest review, rating out of 10, all that stuff. Um, but let's get straight into it because I really, really want to play this game. Here we go. Banjo Kazooie. Love the starting for this. Now, this is by Rare. Uh, Rareware, I should say. And it was a sad day when they no longer created games on the Nintendo system. <laughs> um, being locked into Microsoft. I mean, this title sequence is just amazing. So good. Just that quirkiness. I feel like the sound's a bit off, but I'm not sure. Yeah. The sounds slightly out, which is a little bit annoying. Whoa. Alright, let's get into it. There's no problem when you like emulate your game to record. Which language would you like to use? Uh, English. I love this game so much. Use the control stick to select a game. Game one. Yes, yeah, so I think you could have three save files one with Banjo, one with Kazooie, one with uh, his sister, which I cannot remember the name of. Grantilda. I love this game so much. And I'm limiting myself to such a small amount of time to play it. Ding pot, ding pot, by the bench. Who is the nicest looking wench? Why, it's grunty any day. She really takes my breath away. Cough. <coughs> yes, you're right. I'm rather proud. My looks stand me out from the crowd. Err, uh, but there is this girl. What do you mean? This cannot be. There's no one prettier than me. Why, it's Tootie, young and small. She's the prettiest girl of all. No, 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 you must be mad. Nicer beauty can't be had. Unfortunately, I think you'll find. It's Tootie, she's cute. Well, we'll see about that. <laughs> Hi there, Tootie. What are you going to do today? When my big lazy brother wakes up, we're going on an adventure. Uh. 
Wake up, I want to go on an adventure too. That's hilarious. I used to have a banjo and kazooie toy. I loved it. If Tutti thinks she's fairer than me, I'll steal her looks and ugly she'll be. I think it was a Diddy Kong racing toy. Maybe we had Diddy and Banjo and it, like cars. Is that your br big brother? Where, Mr. Mole? I can't see him. Up there in the sky. I don't think so. Who is that? Come to me, my little pretty. You'll soon be ugly. What a pity. Let me go, you ugly old hag. Don't scratch and bite, my little bear. You'll soon need bigger underwear. I know, she's got her somebody. Help! <laughs> Banjo, wake up! Now! <gasps> what do you mean? Oh, what do you want, Kazooie? That's what I said. I'm, let's get outside, there's trouble. I'm just making up half of the conversation as we go. Because there's, the, the, because there's that delay, it's hard to read sometimes. When games are a little bit behind your actual reading speed. So we can go back in the house, I believe. Oh, this is bringing back feelings. And I believe things change throughout the game in here. I think. I think. We'll have to check this out. Here we go. Listen up, I'm Bottles, the short-sighted mole. I'm Banjo, and this here's my buddy Kazooie. Sure is a strange-looking buddy, Banjo. Can it talk? Better than you can. Goggle boy. What was all that noise about? Where's my sister, Tootie? Ugly witch Gruntilda swooped down out of the sky and grabbed her. Calm down, Geeky. We'll get her back. Where did she go? She flew up to her mountain lair. It's really dangerous, so you'll probably need some training before you go up there. Press A if you want me to teach you some basic moves, or press B if you think you're already good enough. B. You bet we're good enough, bottle brain. Hmm, very well, I'll give you your basic moves. Meet me at the top of Spiral Mountain. There we go, so we've learnt the basics that we need. You said you didn't need my help, so you're on your own until you get inside. That's hilarious. I haven't played this in so long. I've like just forgotten. Mm. I'm sticky, toasty. I didn't get all that. Uh, I can't remember what you're supposed to do with these guys. Yeah, there we go. So if you were um, doing the tutorial, you would go to each of the molehills and learn how to do all these things, I'm pretty sure. And you get honeycomb pieces, which uh, I am an extra honeycomb piece. Collect six of us to increase your energy. This way. Ooh. Another vegetable. Onion. So I find that hilarious that there's a. Uh... 
Just vegetables flying around. Alright, what's up here? More veggies. <laughs> I'm pretty sure they don't fight back either. Oh, whoa, whoa, there's a banjo trophy in there. I don't think I can get that yet, though. Hmm. Give it a shot. Wow, this has been 11 minutes and I'm still just like playing around at the start, enjoying myself. But this is one of those games that it's just, it's brilliant. Oh cool, we could get that. Let's look out for me. I'm an extra life. Oh that's right, and you can swim down as well. Climb up here. Get that life. So this will increase our total honeycomb. Oh, I'm not sure what he wanted there. Alright. So that's all the tutorial stuff completed. And you get the extra honeycomb piece. Alright. Oh, here we go. Heading up the top of the spiral mountain. Yeah, this is just one of those games that I can play over and over, I think. And it's always going to be enjoyable. Although at times frustrating, it's still going to be enjoyable. So you're ready to tackle the witch now. We sure are. Show us the way, bottle boy. Cross the bridge to enter Gruntilda's lair. Look out for me inside. Good luck. And then the music changes. Oh, this, this game is just so good. I, I can't express it enough. Here we go. This is a fine contrast and I'm told will make me young and you oh let me go you fat hag my brother will come and kick your butt <laughs> Rescue you he will not dare there's many dangers in my lair Hurry Klungo push that switch I'm tired of being an ugly witch Yes mistress grunty power is on soon be ready Banjo Help And then there's a number two to this game as well, which is brilliant. There he is. The fun begins, my tricks and traps will see who wins. So I think pretty much that's the same we need to get to each uh What's this? Treasure world shown on the picture, you must fill in the missing spaces with the jigsaw pieces. Uh, I don't think we've found any of those yet. I think I saw one near the lair entrance. Come back when you've found it. So that's one thing that's like brilliant about this game. This is so much. This is the first world, Mumbo's Mountain. Complete the jigsaw picture to open the door. Alright, so the jigsaw piece up the top here. The music for this game is just brilliant. Alright, so we got the jigsaw piece. Hey, it's me, Mr. Jiggy. Now go and find a picture with a piece missing. <laughs> so 
say I just love all, all the music and like the animations is so quirky. Yeah, so we need to get a new skill so we can run up the top. So we have to go and play the level. Um, that's how they set it up, which is really creative. I, I love the whole thing. It really flows with getting the abilities that you need to get um, into each uh, level, or each stage as well. I uh, got the jigsaw piece, Google Boy, great. To fill in the missing spaces on the picture, press A. If you want, don't want to use any jigsaw pieces, press B to leave. Done. Filled in. That's it. The picture is complete, and the door to Mumbo's Mountain is open. That was such an easy fit. The others may just test your wit. It's hilarious, like, what can you say? Here we go. There are three new moves to learn in this world. Find my mo molecules and I'll explain. So pretty much, oh, I'm a note, one of a hundred on each uh, world. Collect us to open note doors. And the little Jinjos, I believe. Jinjos. I always thought they were uh, well, Jinzos, as in like the. Ooh, got a hidden skull. Me Mumbo's token used for Mumbo magic. Um, I always thought they were Jinzo, not Jinjos. Um, Jinzo from Yu-Gi-Oh. It's one of the cards that Joey ends up getting. Yeah, <laughs> that's just a random little fact for you. That was too silly to realize anything else. Such a well-crafted game. The team, the the team behind this were amazing, and it it sucks so much that they had to make the um, locked into making uh, PlayStation, uh, not PlayStation, uh, Xbox Connect games. Yeah, this is a honeycomb box, and I just smashed it before it could tell us. Hmm. <laughs> and then we've got this last one here. Oh, that worked and we got a piece. Grew a clever bear find Conga's gold. You must search for ten of us on each world. We'll help you progress through the witch's lair. Gold. When you're ready to leave this world, return to the start area and stand on the exit pad. Cool. So this pretty much looks like Diddy Kong here. Chimpy hungry wants orange now. Feed Chimpy. <laughs> hey, that's Conga's orange. Put it back. There we go. So I fed Chimpy. We've already played 20 minutes of this game. I did not realize. Oh, Chimpy like Conga's orange. Chimpy help Fat Bear. And bird. And we get another piece of the puzzle. And of course we fall off because I'm way too impatient. So talk to Mr. Moon Man. There we go. Time for the 
buzzard to learn the ancient ways of the egg. I am listening, beetle breath. Hold Z, then press the C to sh C button. No, top C button to shoot. Uh, sounds cool. Anything else? Sure. Press the bottom C instead, and you can shoot them <laughs> from your behind. Sheesh, sounds painful. I wish I'd never asked. Bird brain can carry 100 eggs in her backpack. Oh, and you can also use the control stick to aim while you're crouching. Exciting. Now that you've learned to use the eggs, here's 50 to practice. And you can use a little oil. I'll fill it up for you. Thanks, mate. I haven't learnt the skill that I can hit that with yet. So we'll have to come back to that. And I believe if we go up here... Got rid of him. Bear beat Conga, me give price to bear. So I got a third jiggy. Oh, it's just one of those games. It's just so good. Can't go up there. Alright, so you can go up here because there's like the steps. And we collect the notes. And we kill, kill the termites. Oh, can we make it up here yet? Yes, we can. There you go. Learn a new move here. I call this the big buster jump. Oh, jump into the end, press Z to send Kazooie slamming hard down to the floor. Gulp. I don't like the sound of that, Banjo. Get used to it, Nest Girl. You'll be using it a lot. Alright, so let's go get uh, this. Damn. And get some notes, which is cool. with nice blue stones. That's what I'm trying. Oh, that didn't work. Come on. I have to get it like perfect. And last one. There we go. Another piece of it. But, um, of the jiggies, that's what I'm saying. Four of ten already. So this is ooh, this is what I like, like the fact that it's just it's like a complex game, but at the same time it's it's not like it's easy and enjoyable. I mean, I guess if you're younger, there would be a little bit of challenge behind it, but I love this game. We got a Jinjo. That's three. Now I can't remember if you have to do everything in like one shot when you play this game. Got another jiggy. And then another jiggy here. Uh, yeah, whoa, another jiggy here. 
There we go, look at that. Yeah, I can't remember if you leave the level if it like you lose your score or anything. Nothing behind there. Hmm, I thought there would be. So me Mumbo, best shaman in all game, can help Banjo and Filthy Feathered One. Watch it, hot boy. Mumbo's magic tokens hit by which fine tokens and Mumbo help you. Banjo not got enough token for Mumbo magic. Look at sign, bring more. It's so pretty much bring him five uh, tokens and he'll do something for you. Which is awesome. And you can like always get up the top and do things in the um, his hut, which in this one it's collect eggs, which is cool. Okay, I'm gonna play for five, four more minutes, and that will be half an hour of gameplay. I just, I just love this game so much. It's so hard to actually like stop playing, and I have to go to work too after this. And the termites are hilarious as well. Alright. So up here. So the Talon Trot will let uh, Kazooie tackle steep slopes with ease. That sounds useful, how does she do it? Hold Z then press the left C stick. Continue to hold Z while moving. Alright, uh, Kazooie around with the control stick. Go practice! Well, Banjo, there's nothing more I can teach you on this world. So you do this, and then this uh, allows you to get up ooh, steep areas, and also run a little bit faster. And I've collected enough notes to break the first note door. And there's also a jiggy. Like, it's just, it's so much fun. So much fun that the camera's going flat because I've been recording too much today. Ooh. This is just one of those games that you can always just come back and play over and over. Like, it's just, it's just such an amazing game. Can we get all 100 jiggies? Not jiggies, uh, musical notes. I don't know why I said jiggies. It's not a hundred jiggies. And then there's a ginger as well. That's all the gingers. I don't remember what getting all the gingers does. Oh, it gives you a jiggy. There you go. Being that I have played this game before, it gives me a slight advantage as to knowing where, like, everything is. So that's partially why it would seem like I'm, I guess, doing rather well, if that makes sense. I don't know how to get that one though, just yet. So there are only six more notes in this uh, level. Okay, there's another jiggy. Sorry, like 29 minutes. So there's one. There is one G left. No. That's ah. Uh, that was so close. There's, yeah. Let me try that again. I want to get into that. So there's like a honeycomb piece. So we can also jump. Ah, uh, no, okay. So you have to time that. 
in 30 minutes we have almost like completed 100% the first level. Which I think is really good compared to like some of the other games that we've played where it takes a lot longer. There we go. So we got that and then Alright, so there's literally one thing left to do. I'm actually going to finish this level off um, 100% if we can. If we can also get the Mumbo tokens. I hope there's two inside because otherwise I'm lost to is where they are. I mean, it's probably just me not looking around. Because if they were around, I should be able to notice them. Alright, so in here. Pretty much you're saying that we shouldn't be in here. Now I thought pretty much... Oh no, because we need to turn into an... Ant. How many tokens do we have now? If I press start, is it going to show me? We have four, so there's one more somewhere. Oh, you know what? There's one more thing we've got to do. While I'm remembering to do it. I know there's one more jiggy up the top there. Oh, I just don't feel like I'm going to get it in. Like, quick enough. For my liking. We're going in overtime on a video. Yeah, so that puts a jiggy up on top of Mumbo's mountain. Oh, a little bit short. Oh, wow, okay. Oh, I don't have enough time to finish. I'm really gonna have to end this. I'm just checking one more time to see if there's a Mambo Jumbo token around. Ah, uh, look, it's not here. I'm I'm gonna have to end the episode. Ah, oh, it's just so good though, guys. Look, I love this game, and there's no denying. I said it from the start. I absolutely love Banjo Kazooie, and I do have to give this game a good old. 10 out of 10. <laughs> it's just so amazing. It's one of those games that I can always pick up and always play. Um, probably is a bit of a guide um, so I can get through it quicker in that aspect, but again, absolutely love it. Cannot deny it. I love this game so much. Um, definitely, if you can pick up a copy and play it, um, you will love it too. But that is it for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Please hit that, that thumbs up button down below, that like button. I really appreciate that. Helps me out so much. And subscribe. If you're not subscribed already, uh, to see tomorrow's game, which is Bando Chewy, which is the sequel to this one. So have a great day, guys, and I'll catch you tomorrow. Bye. Hey, guys, thank you so at much for time. watching. If you want to check out the previous video for this series, I don't know. the top left video. If you want to check out my favorite videos from my own playlist, this is check out really the bottom one where I've compiled the them all together, together for you to Whoa. check out. And if it's you're not subscribed, you can hit my logo like up that. in the top right to subscribe. Again, thank you so much, and I'll catch you next time.